What I look for in a guy is someone who makes like $500,000 a year, about six feet tall, compassionate, strong, but soft, likes to spend time with me. Oh uh, yeah, I'm unemployed right now. I got a couple of Deweys, so if you want me to drive, you got to blow into the breathalyzer because I tied a few on earlier, assuming you got a whip. Mature and a great relationship with his mom is a must. Mom's a fucking bitch. I don't even really like living her. We got in a huge scuffle the other day. I almost got physical because she caught me stealing her jewelry after I was pissed at her because she wouldn't let me use her picture to start another Uber Eats pro profile after I got banned from eating someone's food and I wanted to take another crack at it because I already stole a bike. Honest. He's definitely got to be clean. That's a non-negotiable. I actually got little man picking up some toilet paper from school for me right now. Do you think you could drive me there after this? Also, you might have to pop in there and grab it just because I can't really show face there right now. X is still a little perturbed with me because I owe her a couple G's and she needs that for her tuition. Someone who likes to travel. Yeah, I know. She asked me to get a suit for some destination funeral that's like an hour out of town, which I did, but then the security tag had a mishap and it got a little messy so she might have to just go dolo on this one. Willing to cook and just sort of spoil me. Yeah, I like to treat my bitch. I take her to Ruby Tuesdays. We probably have to go to one of the ones out of state though because some of the local ones I've dined and dashed too much at so they're a little bit on to me. A man with integrity. Babe, could you drop by my mom's place and pick up a half quarter from there? Yeah, Dave's plug's gonna come by and pick it up in like the next half hour. You want me to sell drugs for you? It's just under the mattress on the floor. Don't take any though. A man with drive. Someone who's really focusing on his dreams. Oh, I actually got my hands on a tattoo gun. If any of you guys are interested, we could even do it in the car because we probably do have to roll because I got curfew and I got to pick up dip on the way. No, last time I went to your house, your mom tried to fight me. Yo, did you guys see my chick's sister? Pretty fine, eh? Pretty sure she's looking at me too.